Okay guys, it's December here on the Gulf Islands in the North Pacific and we're going to check out a forest full of palm trees. Let's go see how the uh, Swampsoni are doing. There's Fargesia robusta bamboo there with a Taxodium distichum bald cypress growing behind it. And another beautiful morning, sunrise, low temperature is around 40 degrees. And uh, let's go check out these Trachycarpus fortunae variant Swampsonii palms. They're just growing faster and faster. I got my boots on here because it's wet. Look at these things. They're just absolutely amazing. And I do have to watch where I walk because there are so many palm trees here. It's so easy to step on these palms. The forest is absolutely full of them. Okay, that's just some of them. I'm just giving you an update here. You can see how flawless they look. We haven't had any frost yet. This end of the island. There's the bald cypress. It's about 40 feet tall. Pedicytes have uh, gone down to nothing. They're herbaceous perennial. <clears throat> Let's uh, pass this bamboo here and go into the other section. Palm growing there too. Look at that. They, they're everywhere down here because I throw so many palm seeds around, right? They just grow like weeds. Stinging nettles even starting to come up again. Fingers crossed. It is an El Nino this year, which means a milder than uh, normal winter. But, you know, anything can happen in an El Nino. Still get a cold snap. Hopefully not, though. I've seen those winters where we don't get a flake of snow. Look at them in there, man. They are growing so fast, these palms. And I will be throwing some more seed down here. Look at that. They are happy, healthy palms. Amazing, eh? There are literally thousands of them. And then these, these are the biggest ones here. These are all western sword fern in here too. They stay evergreen. Mostly evergreen here, right? There's the bigger ones there. There and here. Growing in our property, the back 40 of our property here on the Gulf Islands, 48 degrees north latitude. <coughs> These ones are growing right along the creek. Some growing in the creek. This is how a North Pacific forest should look, right? Very palmy, lush and palmy. And just overflowing with exotica. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more videos here on Banana JSSI. Cheers.